This conference will now be recorded. Okay. Uh, so uh, we'll be starting our next topic that is material master. Okay. So here we will discuss about material master from customer service module perspective. Okay. So the topics that we are going to cover there, we will see what is material master, importance of material type. Okay. Different material types and the material types used in customer service module. We will understand that material master organizational levels, material numbering, how to how the material numbering happens, external, internal, both we will discuss. Extension of material master. Okay. And then entry aids in material master maintenance. We will see. And then importance of MRP profile, but this is for uh, other modules. Okay. Uh, then how to view the changes metal master metal master uh, change log and the materials relevant for customer service model okay what are the materials what type of materials we need to create for customer service model perspective we will understand that and then metal master reports okay so first we will start with creation of uh, introduction to material we will understand what is material okay so a material can be a substance or commodity that is bought or sold on a commercial basis or is used consumed or created in production so a material can be anything it can be a raw material which is purchased a finished product which is produced and sold to the customers okay or it can be a, a spare parts machine spare part or it can be a stationary anything is called as a material even a service is can be created as a material a material can also be a service so in customer service module we will be normally using two types of materials one is finished products finished products because you are producing the product and we are selling it to the customer so this we require and sometimes service also as a material service because after the sales you you will provide some service to the customer so that service also can be created as a material okay so from cs perspective we will be creating this one. okay or a material can also be a service let's say you are technician going to the customer place and doing some installation so installation service you are doing so that installation also can be created as a material okay with a different material type that we will discuss shortly okay so now what is material master record it contains all the data required to manage a material okay so in the material master you will maintain the information about that material okay this data is sorted according to various criteria okay you will see that criteria so the material master contains information on all the materials that a company procures or produces stores and sells that's what i just okay for a company the metal master record represents the central source for data on material so this metal master which we are creating today not only used by cs it is used by all the areas in a company like purchasing sales uh, uh, quality production warehouse finance everybody okay that is why it is a central source the material master is used by all components all components in the sap logistic system so that's what i explained all, all the departments will use this okay every area of responsibility can have a material master view because different user departments in a company work with same material and each of these departments to st store different information on the material so basically in the metal master every department will have their own view in that view they will maintain their department specific data Okay, suppose in the sales views sales team will maintain their data okay in the quality view quality de control department will maintain their data mrp views planning department will maintain their data in mrp views. like these different departments will maintain their data their department specific data of that particular material in those views okay each department has its own material master record i will show you this we will create a material anyhow okay so this is the one so in the metal master record different departments will maintain their data purchasing will maintain their purchasing data sales team will maintain their sales relevant information of that material uh, production team will maintain manufacturing department will maintain their data in work schedule view. quality team will maintain their data in quality view okay warehouse team will maintain their data in wm views 
okay and uh, uh, planning team will maintain their data in mrp views inventory team in storage and uh, stock at plant storage location views of course basic data is common for all basic data is common for all and fi team finance team will maintain their data in accounting views. so basically it's a centralized source of data okay from cs perspective one is sales sales is important for us because we are going to sell the product okay and sometimes you need a purchasing view because some spare parts which are required for repair activity you need to purchase them spare parts so you need a purchasing view also important for us okay and uh, and also uh, what do you call you need this uh, plant storage view also where you maintain the serial number profile for serialization so these are the views normally important for customer service okay. but predominantly the sales and this plant storage location views okay so now let's continue so before creating the material we need to understand uh, uh, a term called material type okay so whenever you are creating a material material type is mandatory okay so what is this material type a material type groups together materials that have attributes in common so similar kind of materials are created with a material type suppose let's say all the purchased materials all the materials you procure purchase those are created with raw material type roh i'm just giving example okay all the materials which are produced and uh, uh, sold to customers finished products they are created with a material type called fat finished materials okay now all the materials which are uh, provided as a service they are created with a material type called diem service material type okay so similar kind of materials are created grouped together and created with a material type okay the material type controls which departments are able to maintain material type Okay, so suppose let's say raw material you purchase only you are not going to sell it so sales views are not required now finished product you produce it but you will not purchase it normally so purchasing view is not required purchasing information is not required so that this this sentence is whether and how quantities and values are updated in the system this i will show you when we go to system whether the material is procured internally or externally this is again same thing if it's a raw material it is a externally purchased one. if it is a finished product or semi-finished product it is produced internally so that is decided by material type which gl accounts are updated this is for fi okay all these are determined by material type okay and also the material types these are the some of the material types which i just explained raw materials finished products semi-finished products operating supplies those things okay so these material type also control some other other functions like number assignment internal how to assign the material number uh, external or internal it will control procurement type whether it is purchased or produced which user departments has to maintain the data the one which i just explained if it is a raw material sales views are not required if it is a finished product purchasing information is not required that it will control field selection which fields are in, mandatory which fields are optional in the material master that we will see okay and some account determination your gl accounts all those things all these are controlled by material type basically okay so these are the some of the different material types okay raw material roh every material type will have a key this is the key three character or four character key okay uh, semi finished products help finished products fert okay and configurable materials and services these are the ones trading goods packaging materials so in cs module normally we will be using fert because first we produce the product and we sell it to the customer fert and the next one is services this we will be using okay and uh, uh, spare parts machine spare parts we will be creating sometimes with operating supplies but that is mm team will take care of that but most predominantly we will we will be using the material type fert and dye dye services okay 
and these are all the standard SAP material types. You, if you want to create a custom material type, you can create, but that is a responsibility of MM team. MM team will take care of it. Okay. So now we will start with creation of material. We will create a material in the system. Okay. So when you create the material on the initial level, these are the levels. You enter the material number. Then in the main working level, you maintain the data in the different views. Okay like purchasing work scheduling sales accounting mrp forecasting use and on top of that you can maintain some additional data at additional data level. these are the three levels basically these are the three levels okay okay so now uh, let's go and create in the uh, material in the system okay and create a finished product because for us finished product is the main thing because we manufacture and sell it right so for us finished product is the main thing so i will create a finished product okay am i recording this actually the recording is going on right yes yes oh, yeah yeah okay okay so i'll log into the system s4 hana system okay uh, uh, you might be knowing this uh, so the the p codes are uh, create is mm01 change is mm02 and the display the display is mm03 then the p codes okay so let's create a material i'll go to mm01 okay I'll select industry sector, mechanical engineering. It is not there. Huh? Mechanical engineering. Okay. Now I will create a finished product. The reason for creating the finished 